well. It is so nice to finally be sitting in front of the camera again and just getting a chance to talk to you guys. So today I wanted to talk about my hair, these hair extensions, and all that good stuff because I know I have not really had a chance to talk to you guys since I did all these crazy changes. So today we'll just talk about the hair extensions and all that good stuff. So I got these hair extensions from a website called dhgate.com and I will have all the links down below. So this website not only sells hair and like beauty related products, but they sell a ton of other things. So if you are not interested in purchasing some hair, you still might want to take the time to check the website out just to see if you could find anything else you are interested in. So there are a couple of different things that I wanted to talk about because these are things that were very different for me this time around with these hair extensions. So the first thing I wanted to talk about is the fact that I did not get clip-in hair extensions. I actually got them in bundles and I feel like I got a lot more hair this way and I actually just purchased my own clips and made my own hair clip-in extensions out of them. And it is a pain in the ass but it does save a lot of money because I feel like the hair extensions that already have the clips in them can be really pricey whereas these can be a lot cheaper and if you have the patience and the time you might as well just make them yourself. The other thing that was different is I got two different lengths and I got 20, 22 and then another bundle of 22 and that way I'm able to achieve a more natural look because it looks like it has layers without me actually having to put scissors and put them there. A lot of the hair that I've come across is usually only one texture, so it's kind of cool to see what hair is that has a lot of different textures in it. So the different textures that they have in this hair is Brazilian, Malaysian, Indian, and Mongolian. I decided to get the body wave because I was literally just looking for something new, and I always have straight hair, so I decided I wanted to get something with a little bit of wave in it. So after using this hair for about four months now, I could really give a good review on them because I have been using them almost every day and I have actually had no problems with them. With some other hair extensions, after three months of use, they would get really tangled and I take care of them. And these ones, like I said, it's been four months. As you can see, they still look really good and it doesn't get tangly. I did not have to use all the hair, so I do have leftovers that I could use later, but it is kind of nice, it comes in handy, because now I can compare and show you what four months of wear compared to brand new hair, this hair, looks like. And as you can see, there's really not much of a difference. They both still feel really soft, and the only difference is the hair that I have in my head is a lot looser now since I play with it a lot, I comb through it, and this hair has not been touched. So you could kind of see what I mean. So yeah, this video was really short and sweet, but I just wanted to take the time to talk about it because I have had a lot of questions about it. So until next time, I will see you guys on my next video. Bye!